Hey, this is Presh Talwalker reminding you to mind your decisions. Dima saw a strange timepiece in the museum. It had no numbers and it may have been rotated out of position. Also, the second minute and hour hands had the same length. But it operated like a standard timepiece. What time was it? This problem was given to 13 and 14 year olds in Russia. Thanks to Yegor Nazarov for suggesting this. Pause the video if you'd like to give it a try, and when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. So what time was showing? Let's work this out logically. We'll label the hands as A, B, and C. Notice that hands A and C are pointing exactly to major marks on the dial. Thus, if either A or C were the hour hand, then the minute hand and the second hand would have to overlap at exactly the same number 12, and the clock would only have two different hands showing. But that's not the case. Consequently, we can conclude that B has to be the hour hand, as it is not pointing exactly to a major marking. Next, since both A and C are pointing exactly to major markings, the minute hand is a whole number. Thus, the second hand must be at the number 12 to indicate 0 seconds. So now we have two cases to consider. One case is that A is the second hand and it is pointing to 12. We can label around to the hour hand of B. Now C is the minute hand and it's pointing to the number 2. In this case, the time is 10 minutes past the hour, but notice that the hour hand B in that case should only be one sixth of the way between the hours of 6 and 7. It should be closer to 6 than it is to 7. As shown, it's closer to 7. So this case cannot be true. The other case is that A is the minute hand and C is the second hand. So C is pointing at 12, that means A is pointing at 10, and B is between the hours of 4 and 5. The time will be 50 minutes past the hour, and notice the hand B is actually 5 6 of the way to the next hour marking. So this works out exactly, and that's the answer. B is the hour hand, A is the minute hand, C is the second hand, and the time is 4.50. Furthermore, we might conclude that the time is 4.50 p.m. because the museum is open. Not many museums are open at 4.50 a.m. It's pretty neat that you can figure out the time just from these hands without any other markings. Thanks for making Mind Your Decisions one of the best channels on YouTube. Thanks for watching and thanks for your support.